Today on MTG Unpacked, it's Goblin Time! That's right, if you've been waiting for this for a long time, it's finally here. We'll be going through the Goblin album. This is my collection of Goblin cards. We'll also be cracking a pack of Tempest to see if we can find a Goblin on the hunt for Goblins! So this is the start of a new series. We'll be cracking packs, looking for Goblins seeing what I can find. So let's get started here and later on in the video we'll be going through some other random cards I have, a couple of graded cards, a couple of decks and so forth. So stay tuned for that later in the video. So let's get started here. I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to do this but we'll have... okay that should be good enough. We start off, we have Battle Rattle Shaman, Brute Strength, Clamor Shaman, Crazed Goblin, I like the artwork on these old ones, Dragon Fodder, Frenzied Goblin, we've got another one of those. Oh, that was Crazed Goblin, okay. Goblin, Arsonist, Goblin Assault, so many goblins. And you'll notice I'm also putting things in that just have pictures of goblins, so that is also cool. Let's go on to the next page here. We have Goblin Balloon Brigade, Barrage, Goblin Battle Jester, that's probably my favourite there. We've got the Boom Keg, Crater Maker, Dark Dwellers, Electromancer. This one's cool from the Dark Goblin Digging Team. Goblin Free Runner. So you can see we've got all sorts of different sets. This is not a complete collection of all my Goblin cards. I've actually got some more cards will be showing later in the video. This guy is pretty cool, Goblin Hero. We've got The Gathering, Locksmith, Racketeer, Rock Sled, another one from The Dark. So you'll notice I've opened a bunch of The Dark. And a lot of this stuff is stuff I've pulled throughout the channel's history. We've got a Tunneler, Warchief, Goblin War Drums. I love the playmat on this one. So that one's from Masters 25. And leave a note in the comments if there's a goblin I do not have that uh, you think I should go hunting for. I'm going to try to pull all the new goblins for this. So we have Goblin Warpaint, Gravel Hide, Grenzo's Cutthroat. It's pretty cool. My uh, camera stand here is in the way so it's a bit hard to show some of these. Ruffians. Gutter Snipe! He's a favourite of mine, especially in MTG Arena. I like this one here, this Heat Ray. This was something I found. This is uh, out of Urza's block, so we opened a couple of packs of that early on. The Hungry Spriggan. So the first section of the album here is all the regular magic cards, and we also have some unsets as well as tokens. We've got Krinko's Enforcer. This one's pretty cool. Chiron Glider. That is from Acadian Masks, I believe. We got the Lava Step Raider, Lay Waste, another one where it's not a named goblin card, but you've got some goblins there nevertheless. We've got the War Boss, the Flunkies, the Mog, I think that's a whole tribe of goblins. The Fanatic, the Toady, I'm not sure what that set's from there. Leave a note in the comments if you're familiar with that symbol, I'll we'll have to look it up. And then we've got some more. We've got the War Marshal, Mud Button Torch Runner, Oxida Daredevil, Crazy Contraptions. That's another thing I like about the goblins. We've got the Raging Goblin from Exodus. And actually, there's another. Let me grab that while I think of it. We've got this one Survival of the Fittest. So we pulled this one while we were hunting for jackalopes. And actually managed to get one of the most expensive cards in the set, so that was pretty cool. I'll pop a link to the playlist up there so you can check out the Jackalope Hunting series. So I was pretty happy about this one. I like the artwork on this as well. I've got it in a uh, case here, top loader. I was thinking about getting it graded, but I'd like to accumulate a few more cards to grade because it's fairly expensive. So we'll set that aside and continue on here. We have the Rigging Runner, what's this one, Rivalry, Rummaging, and these ones from Ixalan, these are more like Monkey Goblins, 
I think they barely qualify as goblins, but Watsi says they're goblins, so here they are. Scarwood Goblins, another card from the dark. Some cool old artwork there. I like the frame on that one as well. And we got the Scuzzback Marauders, the Shambling Goblin. He is hilarious. I always have a chuckle when I see him. We got the Siege Gang, the Skirt Prospector, the Spear Spewer. Squee the Immortal, there he is on the cover there in case you're wondering. That one's a foil from Dominaria. It's pretty cool. Tadamunge Witch. We've got a Tin Street Dodger. Trash for Treasure. I don't remember opening that set. That might have been one I got from a Patreon reward. Zeta's Commando. Zerta Goblin. And that's it for the regular goblins. So there are probably many omissions. There are actually some I have in other decks around the place here. So we'll be taking a look at those as well in this video. And then right near the end we'll crack Tempest and see if we can add something else. So now we move on to the unsets. Mostly unstable. You'll see a lot of these do not have any mention of goblins, but there are Goblins in the scenes. So we got a boa constrictor boom flinger box of free range goblins. Hilarious. What else do we have here? Gift horse, goblin bookie. <laughs> that one's pretty cool. That's from one of the earlier um, unhinged, maybe. Goblin haberdasher, ground pounder, hammer jammer. So a lot of weird. Goblin inventions here. We've got the Hammerfest Boom Tacular, Headbanger, Joyride Rigger, Crark's Other Thumb. I think that's the takeoff. There's a Crark's Thumb card. We've got Magic Word Party Crasher. This guy is hilarious. So, really loving the artwork here. In Slaying Mantis, it looks like he's taking on some goblins. So, I chuck that one in here as well. Give it a stamp of approval. All right, Steam Flogger of the Month. The service rep Steam Flogger Temp. So there's a lot of Steam Floggers. The Three Headed Goblin. Time out. We got this goblin trapped in a jar here. Very cryptic command. That's another cool one. And then finally here in the album, you're probably totally sick of this if you're not a Goblin fan, in which case, why are you watching? We've got Worker Double, Wrench Rigger, and then we move on to the tokens. So we've got some foil tokens here. This guy is hilarious. He looks sort of like the ones from Survival of the Fittest. A couple of other Goblins there. What is that? Uh, Eternal Masters M19. Got a, I call this one the Horse Goblin. He looks like a horse. Goblin Rogue, some more cool artwork. Alright, so that is the Goblin Album. Okay, we'll be setting that aside and hopefully adding more to it. Although I might need a few more because that album is pretty stuffed full. Okay, next up. So we've got my modern deck there. Or cards from my modern deck, graded cards and goblins versus merfolk. I'm just going to zip through these real quick. Uh, if you want to see the complete review of the deck, I'll pop a link up in the corner so you can check that out. So let's get rid of the lands here. And they do have some tokens. All right, so this one. We get a Mythic Warren Instigator Creature Goblin Berserker, 1-1 one, one for 2 mana. And if you thought I was going to do the Goblin voice the whole video, I, I don't know if that would be physically possible. So, Cleaverite, sorry to disappoint if you were expecting that. Hordling Outburst, I think we saw some of those in the album Goblin Grenade. Uh, that's not a goblin thing. We'll skip over that. Here we are. Krenko's Command. Create two 1-1 one, one red goblin creature tokens. Get a couple of those. And is this a deck that you have? What do you think of it? Or are you more a fan of the merfolk half? Leave a note in the comments. 
Brute Strength, we've got this guy trying to lift a huge boulder. Tar Fire! I like the old artwork on this one. Tribal Instant Goblin deals two damage to target creature or player for a single red. So we get a couple of those. Foundry Street Denizen! We'll be seeing more of him in a moment in my modern deck. So a couple of those. Goblin Ringleader! And I like the variety of artwork here. This uh, looks like some older sets here. Gem Palm Incinerator. Goblin War Driver. Couple of those. Ember Hauler. Goblin Glory Chaser. This guy, I don't know what he's thinking. He's not going to make it, but these goblins are fearless. Boggart Brute. Get some focus there, thank you. We get a couple of those. Goblin Tunneler! We saw this guy in the album earlier. Battle Squadron. Oh, there's like a whole collection of goblins in this crazy vehicle. Goblin Char Belcher. And uh, this one, I think he was in Eternal Masters. And uh, no goblin there. Relentless Assault. We've got another goblin, Krenko Mob Boss. He's a famous goblin, Goblin Rays Runners. Goblin Goon. This is a goblin mutant, Goblin Chieftain, Goblin Rebel Master. Who knew there were so many goblins? Oh my god, Goblin Diplomats. And that's some diplomacy right there. And then I think we just move on to some tokens. Alright. So that was the Goblin half of Goblins vs. Merfolk that came out, uh, I think that was the second to last, maybe near the end of 2017, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, and now we will look at the Goblin cards from my modern deck, my one and only Goblin modern deck that I have not actually had a chance to play because my LGS went out of business before I was able to play it. And the new one, it's a bit of a drive, so I can't really make it there to modern night. So we have the Foundry Street Denizen. Four of those. Goblin Bushwhacker. So we got four of those. And this is uh, the modern day 8 whack. It has a few different variants, but the main thing is you have a ton of goblins. We've got a Chieftain. A couple of those. Now this is interesting. I've got all these different... I think I picked these up from my LGS, a uh, bunch of different artworks for Goblin Grenades. So we've got that one, that's the older one. Another one, different sets, we've got two of those. And this one. So we've got all these variations. I know some cards, they did that with some of the sets. You have different artwork for the various cards. Goblin Guide, he's the guy on the playmat here. He's pretty cool from Modern Masters. 2017 and different artwork here for another goblin guide goblin pile driver and this artwork is hilarious uh, somebody's getting attacked by this goblin uh, so we get let's see i think there were three of those yeah legion loyalist i think we saw this guy in the goblin versus merfolk deck so we get a couple of those, actually a whole playset. Mog Fanatic. A couple of these guys. Three of them actually. Mog War Marshal. These were in the album as well. Another different artwork on that one. Reckless Bushwhacker. Creature Goblin Warrior Ally. This one's from Oath of the Gatewatch. So we get... I think there were four of those, yep. Smash to smithereens! So we've got some foils here. Like the foiling on that one. So there were... Yeah, I think I had all foils for those. That was pretty cool. So that is the goblin component of my 8 whack deck. Uh, let me know if you want to know the exact deck list. I might do a deck tech in a future video. It also has a blood moon among other things. And these guys, yeah, we had a look at those. 
All right, now the graded cards. This is something I've got into recently. I've been wanting to do some graded cards for a long time now, but the goblins were the perfect excuse. So I've been collecting these over the past several months, I think since the beginning of the year. So we've got some BGS graded cards here. Goblin Wizard. Let's see if we can get a nice bit of focus on this dude. There he is. So this is a BGS 9.5 gem mint. Centering edges, surface are all 9.5, corners and 9 from the dark. He's a reserve list card as well. So in theory they won't be reprinting this guy. So whatever's out there is what is out there, except if you crack more packs of the dark. And next we have another Goblin Wizard, sensing a theme here. So this one is a BGS 9 Mint. We've got centering, 9, edges 9, corners 9, surface 9.5. And another 9. Same stats as the previous one. And another one. This one, uh, I think BGS also offers a cheaper option with the grading where they don't have the subgrades. So this is just a, a 9 overall. In case you're not too picky about the subgrades. I tend to like the subgrades just because it gives you a little bit more information. But yep, same artwork. And then the next one is not... Another Goblin Wizard, we have a Goblin Welder. So this is a BGS 9 Mint. Centering edges and surface are all 9.5, but it lost out on the corners, 8.5. I think that's from Urza's. I'm not sure if I can even see why the corners weren't the best. It's a bit hard to see with the camera. But yeah, so those are my graded cards. And no doubt be collecting more in future. Not necessarily just goblins, but maybe some other graded stuff as well. Alright. Finally, the moment you have been waiting for. We're gonna pack we're gonna crack a pack of Tempest, but before we do, we must bless it with a convenient Chandra I just had laying around here. Alright, so let's get stuck into it. And let me know in the comments, are there any other older sets you would like to see opened on the channel as we go goblin hunting? I know I'm trying to select the sets that have a bunch of goblins. So we shall see what we find on our goblin hunt today. Let's try to get this in focus, please. Okay, so first up we have Abandon Hope. Storm front, and I think these are all common. So uh, the last one will be the rare fighting Drake, unless I'm mistaken. In which case, I'll find out during editing. Scorched Earth, Dorthai Marauder. So what is this guy? Is he a goblin? I'm not quite sure. He doesn't. He looks more like a tree folk. So probably not a goblin there. Aftershock, Dorthai Slayer, so more of these guys, Spike Drone, Summon Spike, what is that weird looking thing? Looks more like a strange caterpillar and it's spitting things out, ooh, delightful. Lightning Elemental, Wall of Diffusion. So what is this character here? It's talking about Soltari. Okay, so not a goblin. Wind Drake. Circular Protection Green. I'm really liking the artwork on these old cards. I think we've got we've got three cards left, okay. What is that? Evan Carr's Justice? I don't know what's going on with this guy, but he looks a little sinister. A whole pile of bodies there. Respite. 
And what do we get for the rare? I hope this is the rare. Shatter. So this is an instant for two. Destroy target artifact. Alright, so I'll be running the numbers here. Hopefully this was the rare. If not, I'll find out during editing. So that was our first pack for the Goblin Hunt. Alas, we did not find any goblins today, but I hope you enjoyed taking a look at the Goblin Collection. And we'll be seeing that grow in future videos. I'm not sure how frequently these videos will come out. But let me know what you would like to see, what packs I should crack. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic Gathering unboxings. And be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. An MTG Unpack is now on Patreon. So if you would like to get in on all the pack cracking action, I'll leave a link to that in the description for this video. Thanks for watching and have a great day.